Hello, infidels. <laughs> okay, right. Um, uh, continuing to from what I was doing um, a few days ago, uh, I'm going to show you my current um, thing that is going up. What I've done is uh, clean up the excess um, uh, blocks uh, from the sides. I've actually colored them. Uh, the battery red uh, production um, green and uh, blue is for the hydrogen right might as well see if I got anything yeah 11% might as well refill it right so now I'm fully fueled uh, see belt what I've done uh, for uh, eternity build up I put two solar panels which uh, both uh, almost 100% if not that uh, producing power you can see there the battery is 100% so it would never ever 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 run out of battery right and we fully charged for all the purposes this could be uh, stay there forever right uh, so that's sorted out um i just saw a video from uh, splitzy a very very good video from Splits, uh, splitzy um uh, with the beginning uh, on how to do things so obviously it's uh, absolute pointers of me to to do exactly the same thing although i briefly did it on my last video what i my intent here is to show you uh, the best possible way using modifications because i do not believe uh, in this era uh, to do one windmill uh, wind turbine sorry my apologies wind turbine i'm putting one across uh, along the box that that to me in all honesty is is nonsense right absolutely nonsense right especially when you got uh, other equipment right uh, that it can help you build uh, and be uh, stackable right like in this case i'm looking backwards i've got about what, about 12 or 15 of them uh, stuck one on top of each other accumulating power like no like no tomorrow okay so uh, i end up playing by uh, adding uh, two more drill systems and this is to facilitate quicker intake right uh, i think in my honest opinion for example in the last uh, split c uh, video i saw him uh, uh, giving the tutorial on how to do a, um, a space miner right uh, in my honest opinion i think that is a, a waste of time on the current version or in the current understanding of the game because of these this piece of equipment here and i'm sorry to start drilling the system haha <laughs> funny enough that was a, a rhetorical thing uh, but this drill system does what the uh what the um uh space um, uh, um spacecraft does and far more you don't have to build from scratch you don't have to build the drill you don't have to build the the flying system you don't have to build, build the engine anything whatsoever this thing does it all for you right and this together with the uh, build and repair it is absolutely more than enough for you to get a basic setup so this is what's happening at the moment uh, in my configuration right uh, i'm using uh, three drill systems that eventually i can put three on top and three at the bottom making nine of them and maybe i can expand more at the end uh, at a later uh, usage that's why i put this configuration in this matter so i can um so my production can grow quite quickly right i have got two cargos here right which are special cargos this is a high capacity cargos it is not the vanilla one so no need to put the large cargos and have a big uh, a big bulky thing that's like a, a old age uh, thing right um so you got all this configuration now now what i'm what have i done here right at the moment uh, before i build a big refinery because i don't need it at the moment i've got the five basic components um iron uh, silicon magnesium uh, uh, um, nickel and cobalt right uh, those are being filtered individually because sometimes i need one or the other and what i have decided is uh, to use the drill system to pick up everything that i want and get processed uh, simultaneously 
right and then they get spewed out and put into uh, another set of large uh, large cargo containers so yes these are large cargo containers actually 12 times more each single one of them are 12 times the vanilla uh, large cargo containers this is a tremendous amount and this is for only uh, the ingots okay so it gets processed by the um, refine uh, uh, sorry the assemblers which I'm building uh, five of them right uh, still halfway through the process right and here I've got a um, basic uh, assembler which is uh, I had to re I had to take off the original one that I had here I had the assembler here and I took it off because I don't need any more right but uh, because uh, the new system I got that it all comes in gets processed I don't have any uh, uh, ingots or um, components right so this cannot uh, work properly at the moment right so once I uh, I do everything here right I will get rid of off of that uh, build and repair and I put uh, five uh, builds and repairs here on top which then it will become uh, uh, the system uh, almost uh, autonomous and the only thing I have to do is admin the all right so that is what I'm doing at the moment and what I'm gonna do is end the video here because this was only a show of uh, what is my current setup and I think this is the best setup at the moment and as I said, once I, I, I am comfortable with the amount of uh, ore coming in and being processed, what I will do is plug in here, um, here, I will plug in here and carry on backwards here. I will put two, uh, two refineries uh, and both of them will be independent to each other, which will be one for gold and one for silver, right? And these ones can either remain the same or I get rid of them and I put the normal refinery. It doesn't matter. At least the setup is, is ready. Okay. And that's basically what I wanted to, to inform you of. Uh, I will, uh, what I will do in the next time is, well, off camera is uh, use the drill system. What am I doing? Well, no, I've done many videos about the drill system that you can actually see how it works. It's just a, a pure beauty, right? And and yeah, that's it. So I hope you enjoy uh, my setup. If you got any issues, comments, or even criticisms, I'll take it. Re really, I take it. But as far as I'm concerned, uh, this is not a, a bad uh, initial setup. And with this, oh, by the way, my goal will be to um, let's see how much I I've got. Yes, I've got enough. So my goal here is to build a um, a uh, ship here in this area. So what I can do now, uh, let me do it now, might as well, right? Uh, put paint and I will do the standard white, okay? And no, uh, no coloring or anything like that. So I can start from here, right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Okay, from here, yeah, this, this will do it, right? So from here outwards, I will I will start coloring. I will stay red, just to the pig halfway. Oh, I haven't done it. Sorry, uh, red. Okay, so this this will be the edge of my uh, of the left side of the ship. Right, uh, just very briefly. Just put this edge here. Obviously, it's going to be a large grid. Yeah. Hold down a bit. Right, so something like that. Okay, so I'll take it off. Uh, get rid of the with zero. Right, so that's basically a very very crude way of doing it. Right, but what I'm doing, if you look at it from that this point, that you are will be looking at the left side of the ship. I will be uh, uh, building throughout here. Okay, well away so I can still build my refineries and whatnot here right and the next thing what I will be doing is doing the base either frame of it uh, just to gather how much of a distance that I want 
uh, and then I will build uh, some more drill systems dedicated only for the for for this ship, right? And it will be based for solely at the moment for ice because I want to put power on this and it will be uh, run by uh, hydrogen engines. Okay, uh, and that will serve two purposes. One, it will feed into the energy here, right, uh, to give more power to the base. So I'm killing two birds in one go. Because if I start building stuff here, it will it will use the resources of these uh, wind turbines. And I don't want to do that. Okay, so that's basically uh, my uh, next goal. I don't know if I do it after this, right away or uh, I'll do it in another time but this is basically what I wanted to to convey at the moment okay until next time have a nice engineering uh, design bye bye yeah let me line down and then go catch you later boys and girls